Howdy tidy everybody, this is Tom with Kermit Rev Scale Models coming at you with my start video for the small scale group build that runs the month of February, the shortest month, hosted by Sean, the scale model car guy, and Brian, BG's model workshop. So I'm doing basically the same kit that BG's doing, except mine is in the Martini livery, um, and his is in the L&M livery. However, um, I don't know if I'll be able to do that because my decals are kind of toast. I'm going to try to see as I get closer if I can get that paper that stuck to it all these years off. If I cannot, which I would love to do because I like the martini livery. If I can't, I have ordered from IndyCar, um, Indy, is it Indy decals? Um, I have the uh, RC decals as well, which are really, really nice. Plus, I picked up while I was on their side, I picked up some uh, of the tire decals. Um, tires look okay, but they do have like one side raised so, and one side not raised, so I could use the one side that's not raised for the decals. Um, this kit is originally from 73. It's an AMT Matchbox kit, um, but this one is a 1976, 76 or 79 repop. So not a lot of parts, uh, molded in white and gray and chrome, as you see, two, two sprues of chrome here. Um, undercarriage being very uh, smooth, and then very little engine detail. It's basically just, you know, the outside. Um, nothing major. Um, I believe the uh, rear, where the engine is, since it's a mid-engine car, um, as you can see, it will flip open like that. And it does come with a driver, so it'll look exactly like what was on the box art. NRC Cola livery, probably. Keep our fingers crossed. Uh, if anybody can give me some information as to how to possibly save these decals, that would be much appreciated. Um, as you can see, that paper is kind of rolling up. So as I try to pull back very softly, um, you know, it, it, it's doing okay so far, but that was where it wasn't really soaked on there or stuck on there. Um, this part that's not done yet, that's because it was the part that was the most stuck. Um, so if you got any ideas on how to lift it up, I didn't want to just put water because I didn't want to activate the decals. Um, so if there's any other tricks somebody out there might have, uh, just let me know, post it in the comments. But there's my entry and I might work on something even smaller on, uh, on the side, but we'll see. But that's what I got. It's got the, this, the AMT Matchbox Porsche 91710 Can-Am car. Uh, from the mid early to mid 70s. Okay, um, I'll put the links to the other guys' uh, channels in the description. I'm sure everybody that watches my channel is obviously already subscribed to these guys, um, but if not, I'll put them in there for you. Get over there and subscribe, ring the bell. Some great builders, um, and again, thanks to those same guys for hosting this group build again this year. It's really cool. I like this. Um, it'll be my second Porsche. In a row so we'll see how it goes hopefully it'll turn out um pretty good so as always hope everybody's staying safe staying warm with the cold that we've had all across the country and as always howdy toddy and god bless